Since the organization of the U.S. Marshals, the police of the United States have always carried different sidearms. And that has varied from time to time, but today, the technology and the guns is so advanced, it's incredible the type of guns police can carry. So what we're going to take a look at is we're going to take a look at the top 10 police guns. Number one, Glock 19. This is a little bit shorter in length and height than the Glock 17. The Glock 19 is a 15 round, nine millimeter duty weapon with a 0.49 inch trigger travel with trigger safety. It is accurate, dependable. It takes a beating and still does the job. Had a steel slide and polymer frame and can endure anything that Glock endures. And of course has the typical Glock sights. Number two, the six hour P226. This full size duty pistol comes in nine millimeter, 40, 357 SIG. It is a double action, single action trigger and comes with a decocking mechanism. It was built in 1980. Is the duty pistol of choice for military and police worldwide. It was originally based on the P220 design, but has a double stack. Six sights, in my opinion, are about as good as sights get. Number three, the Smith & Wesson MP9. This full-side duty pistol is a nine millimeter, 17 plus one capacity. It is striker fired with a trigger safety, steel slide, polymer frame, and low profile sights. This gun never really appealed to me after shooting it once myself. But a good friend of mine on security at church has this gun and carries it regularly. And every time I go to the range, he has the tightest groups of anybody on that range, regardless of what pistol we use. So really when it comes down to, if you know how to use it, the Smith & Wesson 9 is exceptional. Number four, the Beretta 92. The 92 is a series of semi-automatic pistols, typically a nine millimeter, designed as a duty pistol. It was not only one of the most used duty pistols in the 80s, 90s, and 2000s, but also the U.S. military sidearm, and is most notable for its accuracy. It is a double action, single action, has a 17 plus one capacity, but the Beretta 92 is really exceptional and still continues to be a great sidearm choice. Number five, the Glock 22. Introduced in 1990, this is a 15 plus one capacity 40 caliber duty pistol, and this made the 40 caliber a viable round for police and military. It's a steel slide and polymer frame, striker fired of course. It is durable, accurate, reliable. The Glock 22 is probably the most used 40 caliber pistol sidearm out there in the world. Number six, the HK45. This is a semi-automatic 45 caliber with a 10 plus one capacity. It's a steel slide and polymer frame, hammer fired full size, and it met the demands of the military forces using the 45 caliber. They make an HK45 tactical that comes with a threaded barrel. It's extremely accurate and durable. My sister-in-law carries this pistol regularly, but if I had to choose a duty pistol in 45, it would most certainly be the HK45. Number seven, the 1911. Invented by John Browning in 1911 and dubbed the M1911A, this is the most widely used sidearm of the last century and still is being used by many today. It's almost three million produced with countless gun manufacturers still continuing to produce the 1911 all the time and it still is a duty pistol of choice. Number eight, the six hour P229. So this is a smaller version of the 226, single action, double action trigger that comes in a nine millimeter 40 or a 357 SIG. It has a decocking mechanism, steel slide, alloy frame, even though it's considered a compact, you can get up to a 15 round capacity of nine millimeter with this handgun. Number nine, the Remington 870 pump action 12 gauge shotgun. Invented in 1950, the 870 shotgun is the choice for police and military with over 11 million 870s produced. There's 21 countries using this as their military shotgun and chances are every police officer out there has used the 870 at some point in their career. And finally, number 10, the Colt M4. This is a shorter, lighter variant of the M16A1, firing the 5.56 by 45 NATO, typically used with a 30 round magazine. For me and you, it's a semi-auto, which is also available for police and military with the selector switch for full auto or three round burst. Countless police and military use the M4 as the rifle, 
a why not with effective range of over 600 meters. So there you go. There's my top 10 list for police guns. You probably have a bunch more I didn't mention. Put them in the comments below. If you like this video, click like and subscribe. You can also now find us at GodFamilyAndGuns.org and also on Facebook. You can also now be a patron of this channel and our Patreon link is below. But by far the most important part of this YouTube channel is it's a ministry to us and we take prayer requests. So please don't ever hesitate to send that stuff in. Thank you for watching this episode of God, Family, and Guns. And as always, love God, love your family, and love guns.